the Guiana Revenue Authority has embarked on the implementation of the e-payment feature in our secure world, which will facilitate the payment of all customs declarations through electronic medium. This form of payment would be made by the importer or declarant via the bank to the GRA. The duties and taxes will be deducted automatically from the importer's bank account upon confirmation of the payment. To create a payment order, access a document library and follow the path Asecuta, Accounting and Payment, Payment Order. Right-click on the Payment Order e-document and select the option New. The document will open with the declarant's code, name and address populated. Proceed to input the company code, then press the tab button on your keyboard. Enter the registration reference of the document you wish to pay. From the drop-down menu provided, select the relevant customs office. Input the year of registration, the registration serial and the registration number, then press the tab button on your keyboard. The model of declaration and assessed amount fields will automatically populate. Proceed to click the Add Declaration icon to add a declaration to the list of declarations to be paid. The information will appear in the table below. You may add multiple declarations to be paid by repeating this procedure. If you wish to process non-declaration payments, you may utilize the Other Duties, Fees and Taxes section of the document. From the drop-down list provided, select the relevant payment code. The description field will automatically populate. Input the reference and the amount to be paid, then press the tab button on your keyboard. To add the information in the table below, click the Add Transaction icon. The various tax types and corresponding amounts to be paid will be reflected in the Amount by Tax section of the document. Once all relevant information is inputted, click the thumbs up icon to verify the document. If no errors exist, a dialog box will appear stating Document Verified. Click the Generate icon to save the payment order. A dialog box will appear indicating Transaction Completed. A reference number will be assigned to be used to locate the document. Click the check icon to continue. To retrieve the payment order, right-click on the payment order e-document and select the option Find. The payment order finder will appear. Input the relevant search criteria in the fields provided. It is recommended that the reference year and reference number be used as the key search criteria. Once inputted, click the search icon. The search result will be displayed by the finder. If you wish to modify the payment order, right-click on the search result and select the option Update. You may add or remove declarations and other payments. To remove a declaration or other payment from the payment order, Right-click on the relevant information line and select the option Delete. To add declarations or other payments, you may follow the steps identified earlier in this video. Once modifications are complete, click the thumbs up icon to verify the document. If no errors exist, a dialog box will appear stating Document Verified. Click the check icon to save the changes. A dialog box will appear stating transaction completed. Click the check icon to continue. To submit the payment order for processing, right-click on the search result displayed by the finder and select the option Proceed to Pay. A dialog box will appear indicating transaction completed. Click the check icon to continue. Right-click on the search result once again and select the option Print Preform. A dialog box will appear requesting confirmation to print the document. Select the option Yes to continue. The preform will appear in the format of a PDF document. This document will be used to process the payment at the respective bank. If you wish to modify the payment order after printing the preform, 
Right-click on the search result displayed by the finder and select the option Undo Proceed to Pay. Right-click on the search result once again and select the option Update to make the necessary modifications. Once modifications are complete, select the option Proceed to Pay. Click the check mark on the dialog box to continue. Right-click on the search result and select the option Print Preform. Click the check mark on the dialog box to confirm action after which the preform will appear. Once payment has been processed, an automatic mail will be sent indicating the lane assignment. Locate the payment order using the Finder. Right-click on the search result and select the option Details. The status will be reflected as Paid. Please be advised that the Guyana Revenue Authority will not issue a payment receipt to the importer for electronic payments. As such, it will be the responsibility of the brokers and importers to print the Executor World receipt. To print the receipt, right-click on the search result generated by the finder and select the option Print. A dialog box will appear requesting confirmation of the action. Click the check icon to continue. The receipt will appear in the form of a PDF document.